Hello friends, my name is Ankush. In this video, we are going to see how to start the standby database. And also we are going to see uh, whether how to check whether the primary database is in sync with the standby database. So this is my primary server which is in black color and even you can see the note over here and in the white color you can see this is my standby server. So on the first primary server I am checking whether any database is currently running or not. So initially we are starting our primary database. The primary database always should be in open stage. Currently I am not seeing any database which is running on the primary server. I am setting the environment for the primary database and starting the database. The primary database always in the open stage and uh, physical standby database needs to be in a mount stage here we have started the primary database let me check the status of the database here okay the instance name is primary the database role is primary so this is what we need to check on this server and the production mode is maximum performance okay now we are going on the physical standby database let me check whether any database is currently running here or not by using the pmon process i am setting the environment So let's clear the screen. First we need to start the database in no mount stage. Start up no mount. As I said earlier, the physical standby database is supposed to be in the mount stage. Okay. So here we have started our database in no mount stage. Once the database is in no mount stage, then we will start our database in a mount stage but with the standby database option. Just copying this command and putting it here. I will make sure to copy all these commands in our description box so that you can refer for your future reference. Okay, let me check the status of physical standby database here. The instance name is std and currently it is in the database role is standby if you are checking the status of uh, physical standby database it is in mount stage so in this way we can start our physical standby database in a mount stage okay now we are going to see whether the primary database is in sync with the standby database in order to check this thing i have this command handy with me so let me tell you how this uh, this is going to work as per the data card architecture the archive logs will be shipping from the primary database to the standby database if the mrp process is currently running then it will apply those archive on the standby database so the same thing we are going to check here whether those archive has been shipped and applied over on the standby database. So first of all we are checking it on the primary database. So the current sequence is 28 and we have put here the condition as applied equals to S. It means to say 
it is checking only those count where the RKI logs are applied okay so current sequence is 28 the same thing we need to match on the physical standby database here also max sequence is 28 if the max sequence is differ from the primary database to the standby database then there are some other option through which we can you know match this max sequence count maybe by taking the incremental backup and restore it to the physical standby database but in this scenario what you can see both the primary database is in sync with the standby database because the max sequence I here I can see as a 28 and on the primary database also 28 so in this video we have seen how to start the physical standby database and to check about whether the primary database is in sync with the standby database if you have any queries you can write mail to me or you can also put it in a comment box thank you so much for watching this video i will come up with the next video like uh, how to check the uh, you know maybe there is some gaps in between the primary and the standby database and how to recover it okay and uh, for training purpose also you can contact me thank you so much for watching this video bye bye